Yo, what's going on guys? Denti here. Uh, this is gonna be a short, hopefully, and sweet video. Uh, if you are here, you're probably having trouble with Anthem like I've been having trouble with Anthem. I've been getting 100% uh, CPU usage, 100% GPU usage. Uh, actually, let me brag this over so you guys can see it. Boom. Uh, this is where, as you can see, it's at 86 right now. Uh, I've been getting this weird, I updated the NVIDIA drivers. You guys have probably updated the NVIDIA drivers. There was a special Anthem update as of this video, which is February 25th. I think it was, came out on the 23rd or the 22nd. Um, I was fine before that, but this is similar to the VIP demo and it's pretty much unplayable. I stream from the same rig that I game on. So, um, whether I was streaming or not, if anyone's having this issue, hopefully this helps. Couple of steps. We're gonna get through it real quick. So, I don't know what this is. I'm gonna go all the way through. I don't, this is a new setting. 1910. Such a pain in the butt to get to right now. Right? Uh, I'm gonna set it to 60 hertz. My monitor has 140 hertz refresh rate. I should be able to do this and for it not to just freak out completely. But as you can see, we are like choking out 97% CPU just jumped to it's at 83. It's at 100% or 99% GPU the whole time. Uh, we're going to leave. We're going to come back. We're going to change some settings. And when we're all said and done, this should be usable for anyone i don't know that it's going to work for everyone but hopefully it works for you all right so let's crash this we're going to alt f4 right we're going to go into the nvidia control panel i've already got an open for you the most important step because i'm a too long didn't read type of guy uh is my monitor is set to 144 hertz i had to manually set my monitor to 60 hertz which sucks because I have 144 hertz monitor and I want to play games at 144 hertz. This is the only game that's ever given me trouble like this and maybe Apex. So maybe it's an origin thing. So we're going to do this. Hopefully this video doesn't get messed up when I do that. It like flickered. All my monitors flickered. Okay, we're back. Um, we're going to click yes. Uh, I also changed some other settings. Manage 3D settings. Uh, I guess I should have told you to get there. But so you open up your NVIDIA control panel. You can right click on it down here right go to nvidia control panel click on that open it up click on manage 3d settings you want to go to program settings right boom 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 you're gonna load today all right you're gonna click a drop down you're gonna have some programs in there your program may be there it may not be there regardless you want to click add you want to find your exe wherever you installed anthem it may be in the list it may not be in the list but once you get it there uh, these are the settings that I change and I've used this for other games like Fortnite, etc. in the past uh, Maximum pre-rendered frames one I wanted to make sure that it was rendering from my GPU and not like my onboard motherboard So I put uh, my graphics card, which is a 1080 uh, Preferred maximum performance for the power management mode. Uh, I turned off threaded optimization I think that actually made a difference in my testing, um, but it may not make a difference for you. Uh, vertical sync, I turned on, but I also tested it with off, and this also works. And then uh, virtual reality pre-rendered frames, I set to one, but honestly, it probably doesn't matter, but I just did it. Okay, so the other screen to change your resolution, if your resolution is higher, if you have a higher frame rate monitor, whether it's 140, 240, whatever, uh, this is where you do it. Change resolution. You come in here and you change it to 60 hertz. Now, does that suck? Yes, maybe. But until they optimize their game, this is what we're going to have to do so we can play it and enjoy the game that we're paying for. So we're going to move this out of the way. Boom. As you can see right now, I'm recording. So I've got a little bit of usage more so than normal. It normally it would be like in the single digits less, probably under five. We're going to leave that up. We're going to relaunch Anthem. We're going to change some settings We're gonna, essentially we're just turning on vertical sync. Um, you saw that I changed the settings to 1080, 19, I, I set it to 1080, right? Yes, from 720. And hopefully it doesn't reset because every time I turn this off and turn it back on, it goes right back down to 720p. So it should be on 1080. Pretty sure I did that. As you can see up in the right hand corner, we can tell actually that it's just like kind of choking out look at that it's kind of like moving a little choppy right 
I'm trying to do this video fast for you guys. I don't usually make videos like this, so it's not really my speed, but this was frustrating me and I thought it might help someone and I just wanted to help someone who may be suffering the same frustration I was having. So we're going to go into video display settings. It stayed at 1080, so we're good. Um, we're actually going to change this to 60 frames. Okay. And we're going to turn vertical sync on. We're going to apply. Ch yes. And now let's bring up the CPU. And as you can see, it was at 100% still, 100% ish still on my CPU. And for reference, my CPU is a 6700. Uh, and it's dropped down to about 47 ish percent. It saw it go 55 there, but 48, 47. 50%, we'll just say 50%, and again, 50% here on the GPU. I don't think it matters what the game settings are on. I've tested this with high, ultra, low. I have it on low right now just because I was testing, but it really doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what the settings are. It changes nothing. That just goes to show you how optimized it is right now. Hopefully, I don't sound like I'm having a negative tone because I actually am enjoying playing this game. Uh, hopefully, this helps someone. If it did, drop a like on the video, subscribe if you want to. Uh, I play games like this, Looter Shooters Division 2 is coming out, very hyped about that. Uh, and I hope you have a dope day. Take care.